about the Knicks because it's your boy Chris with an X. All right, so I want to talk about the whole damn Daniel situation and um, just social media people making things go viral. Um, stop making stupid stuff go viral, y'all. We got so many people who got so much good talent, real talent, real music, and we sitting up here letting small stuff go um, viral. Now, with that being said, because in this generation, people like to make stupid shit go viral. However, I'm not too mad at it because in this generation, um, this is like one of the first things that go went viral that didn't wasn't stupid, like the knockout challenge where you somebody you know sit on your chest and you, you pass out, or you know that challenge where you jump on the train tracks and then you wait for the train to get close and then you jump off. You know, so that's why I'm not too mad at it. It's just you know, it, it's something that it was something that didn't uh, wasn't life injuring life threatening um as for the people who got jealous of that his fame you know yeah it was a stupid video yeah it wasn't really funny to me but to put a uh, um to put a SWAT team to have a SWAT team come to his house and then hack his uh, um, Twitter to hack his Twitter and put racist stuff now that's just some hater shit if you don't want something stupid to go viral, don't click it, you know. It's us as a people who make stuff like that go viral. Um, so, you know, that's just my whole take on the damn Daniel situation. One of the things that I do not absolutely agree with going viral is this Tracy Armand chick. Who's, uh, she was on the Dr. Phil show. She was obsessed with Miley Cyrus and she was on the catfish. Uh, some catfish show where you catfish people she recently released a video saying release all rapists from jail and in the video she was just talking about first of all she was in her her bra and panties and then and then you know touching her dry ass weave you know and then she was saying something about like oh you know when a guy you know fuck me I want him to you know take my stuff I don't want no pussy ass dude. You know, a lot of people, yeah, there's a difference between, you know, rough sex and rape. Yeah, you know, a lot of girls like rough sex. Um, there's nothing wrong with rough sex. Um, yeah, you do want somebody, you know, to take you, you know. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm, yeah, anyways, like I was saying, you know, but rape is something totally different that's very traumatizing to people you know and I didn't agree you know with her you know trying to match the two together rape is something different and you go you, you can't be letting stupid ass people like that go viral because this chick obviously does anything to get attention you know I don't like people like that I don't think it's funny you know a, lo a lot of the people in the comment section was going in on her so I agree with that but this chick just needs to disappear, at least off social media. She needs to get help. Something is obviously wrong with her. You know, that's an example of, you know, something going viral and something being abused. It is not cool, nor is it funny. So, yeah, that's what I just want to talk about. Social media, you know, let's start getting people with good talent, raw talent. Um, you know, people with something that's actually funny you know, to to go um, viral. Like the why the fuck you lying, that was funny. I, you know, I, I can, you know, I can di dig that. All right, anyway, so comments, questions, concerns, comment section below. Anything you want to talk about, you know what, what you know where to leave it at. Until then, this has been your boy, Chris with the X. Peace. Damn, Chris.